Welcome to the Weekly Dose with the Calgary Zoo. Today, we're going to take a journey to the Wachau Community Hippo Sanctuary, known as the WCHS in Ghana. A while ago, we talked about the incredible biodiversity within the sanctuary region, but today we're going to focus on something different. We're going to focus on the community aspect of our community conservation work with WCHS and the people that call the sanctuary home. Around the world, lots of places that are home to species that are at risk are also places where local communities depend on the natural resources there for livelihoods. Community conservation recognizes that when communities experience benefit related to wildlife conservation, they make decisions that preserve the habitats and the populations and that can benefit them as individuals, families, and communities. The Calgary Zoo has played a supporting role to the WCHS by offering guidance, building capacity, creating sustainable employment, and monitoring outcomes for biodiversity as well as local livelihoods. The community-managed WCHS has delivered tangible benefits for both wildlife and human communities. The goals of WCHS include conserving hippos and the biodiversity of the region, alleviating poverty in local communities through infrastructure development, and creating sustainable livelihoods. Local communities benefit from the revenue of ecotourism activities and shea butter processing, as well as infrastructure improvements such as new visitor centers, two tourist lodges, a cell phone tower, solar lighting projects, the construction of two primary schools, and 28 boreholes for water. Local community-run water and sanitation committees maintain these boreholes, which provide residents throughout the sanctuary with easily accessible, clean water. In order to support the coexistence of humans and wildlife, the land within WCHS is divided into specific zones. The most important hippo and wildlife habitat is protected within the core zone, which follows the Black Volta River. The rest of the sanctuary, known as the development zone, is set aside for human use. Around 10,000 people in 20 different communities live within this zone and use the land primarily for farming and livestock. Stock. There are four groups in the sanctuary, each with distinct languages and religions. Hippopotamus have important cultural significance for both Walla and Birafor people, and their legends and taboos contribute to the local conservation ethic. Wachau Community Hippo Sanctuary serves as an example of how international conservation and development can be intertwined for the good of both local people and healthy ecosystems. Thanks so much for tuning in to today's Weekly Dose. We look forward to sharing more about our global community conservation efforts, and we hope you enjoyed learning a little bit more about Wachau Community Hippo Sanctuary.